This video is some extra practice on rounding numbers, specifically rounding to the nearest hundredth. To do that, we have to know where is the hundredth position in our number. In this large number that I'm using as an example, we can see the hundredth position is here. It is the second digit to the right of the decimal, and that's the digit that we focus our attention on while we round these numbers. In the first example, we have 0 0.834. The three is in the hundredth position. And the number to the right of it is a 4, which is less than 5, so we're rounding down. 0 0.83 is our answer, rounded to the nearest hundredth. Now we have 0 0.647. The 4 is in the hundredth position, and the number to the right of it is a 7, which is bigger than 4, so we're rounding up. We have 0 0.65 as our answer. The next example is 13.008. This 0 is in the hundredth position, and the number to the right of it is an 8, which is bigger than 4, so we are rounding up. 13.01 is our answer. Now we have 25.002. This second zero is in the hundredth position, and the number to the right of it is a 2, which is smaller than 5, so we're rounding down. So our answer is 25.00. You might think that's the same as 25, and in fact, it is the same number as 25 but we still have to show the 0, .00 so that we can show our number is rounded to the nearest hundredth. Now we have 0 0.00817. This zero is in the hundredth position, and the number to the right of it is an eight, which is bigger than four, so we're rounding up. Our answer is 0 0.01. And now we have 0 0.02444. The two is in the hundredth position. The number to the right of it is a four, which is less than five, so we round down. Our answer is 0 0.02.